Uh, so you do not believe the church has the right to change the law? That's exactly right. I do not believe that the church has the right to change the law. I don't even believe that Jesus could change the law. If he could have, he wouldn't have had to die. For the Bible says where there's no law, there's no transgression. Where there's no law, there's no sin. He died for sin. If he could change the law, he wouldn't have to die. Now, if the church can move heaven and earth, Luke 16, 17, then I will grant the church can change the law. Next, please. Instead of babies being destroyed with their heathen parents by the Israelites, couldn't God have spared them because they were innocent? There is in this question, I'm not saying it's intended, but there is in this question an implied criticism of God. Couldn't God have done differently? What's wrong with him? I'm not saying you meant it that way, but that's what's implied. I would like to give you a sincere, heartfelt bit of counsel. When I say you, I don't know who wrote the question. I mean all of us. Never allow your mind to second-guess God. Would you say amen to that? Amen. Now, God could have done whatever he willed. And remember, God sees the end from the beginning. And there were people who had gone so totally away from God that even their offspring would simply have been heathens full of hatred toward truth. And God knew it, and it was best to rid the world of it. Oh,